Hello! Excuse my English because it's not good. Today we are going to make chicken stroganoff. Originally the stroganoff is made with meat, but in this case I'm going to do it with chicken, with chicken breast. I prepare it well and it is very good. And today I want to share it with you. It is very fast and then we have a warm lunch or dinner. So without losing more time, we will give the ingredients and we will start. 500 grams of chicken breast cut in the regular pieces. One onion large cut into small cubes. 150 grams of slices mushrooms can be fresh or canned. A large carrot cut into slices. 100 grams of peas. 2 tablespoons of butter, 4 cloves garlic crushed, 250 milliliters with equal to a cup of chicken broth, 125 milliliters of white wine that is equal to half a cup, 200 milliliters of cream of milk that is equal to 3 quarts of cup, olive oil to taste, a tablespoon of corn starch, salt and black pepper to taste, a teaspoon of sweet paprika. Now we are going to put to heat and deep frying pan. We add a spoonful of butter to him and a trickle of oil. We let it warm well that the butter melts. And now we are going to add the chicken and we are going to saute it. We have to let it seal and we keep the fire high. We turn it over mix it well after a few minutes. When we see that this is well sealed we're going to remove it from the pan. Let's reserve the chicken. To this sauce, add the other spoonful of butter. Let it melt. And add the cooked onion. And crushed garlic and let it saute a little to soften the onion. All this always at high heat. And after two minutes, the onion has already become soft. Add the sliced carrot, sliced mushrooms, and now let it saute a few minutes more. After a few minutes, Add the peas Add the paprika Add the teaspoon of salt And half a teaspoon of black pepper This is to your liking And after a few minutes we had it Skipping, add the chicken broth, the white wine, and the cream of milk. Mix very well. Add the tablespoon of corn starch. Mix very well so that it dissolves well in this liquid. Now cover it and let it start to boil. And at the moment we see that it has already begun to boil, add the chicken again. Mix very well, cover, lower the fire to medium low. 
and we will leave that is uh, cooked for about 10 minutes, more or less, so that the chicken was cooked well and the rest of the ingredients. And we will have the chicken strong enough ready. Half of the time to the five minutes, we check to see how it is going around. We try to see if it is okay with all ingredients. Mine is perfect. So I'm going to let it cook for five more minutes. And it will be ready. After 10 minutes, our chicken strong enough is ready. I will turn off the kitchen and will serve with white rice and a salad. And here we have our strong enough chicken dish accompanied with the white rice and the salad. And I hope you like it and prepare it because I know you will like it. I hope you like this recipe of this chicken strong enough in my way of preparing it. So I guarantee you that you will like it because it is very tasty. Now I'm going to try to see if it's good. delicious. It's really good. And since you are in the channel, subscribe me. Below the video in the description, I leave the right and recipe for you to copy and then prepare this dish. I'm going to say goodbye. I see you in the next recipe. Bye!